Now you can actually see the wiring raceway in there. And then you can't see the one in there. So I just wanted to show you how this electrical raceways work uh, before I got all the panels up so you can see actually how they work. Now, you want to put all the panels up first and then you come back and put the electrical in. So here's the horizontal electrical raceway. Real simple, easy to use. Just shove the wire through and then when you see it pop its way out there, you can just take and pull out what you need, bend it down. Now the vertical one works the same way. You shove it in either from the top or bring it down to the bottom and just shove the wire through. And as it comes out. So now as far as the wire goes, it's always easiest if you put the wire in first, then shove it in to the box. And uh, now you can uh, put your screws in there, fasten it in place. And then for those of you asking as far as securing the wire for the electrical code, just the expanding spray foam uh, filled in that area. And if you don't want to get carried away with the spray foam, you can just cut down part of your block and you can put that back in. You can put the spray foam in there, then you can put the, the block back in place. One trick for sliding wire in easily so it doesn't get hung up is to take and bend over the end so it doesn't have any sharp thing to catch on. Now it has a smooth transition. It's not going to get hung up. So when you go to put it in and run your horizontal, now this you can run the eight or 10 feet without a, no need for a fish tape or anything. You can just shove it through from box to box. No problem. And same thing with the vertical raceway. Line it up. And slide it Then you put your box in. Put your wires in your box. Slide the box into place. Screw right into the end so fast stuff. One of the neat things about these boxes is they're adjustable in and out, so you just adjust the screw and where you want your box to be. So if you're thin or if you're putting short side on or something thicker, you'll put it up here. Now you'll spray foam in there, that will count for the code required attachment for the wire. You could also spray foam and put a piece of scrap foam back in there if you wanted to use a little less foam. But it's as simple as that.